Badminton today is a world sport, not only at club and country level, but at an international standard the game is more competitive than ever before. Countries like Korea have even adopted it as their national sport. The days of genteel matches with heavy wooden rackets are long gone. Not only the techniques, but the technology have changed the face of the game. Whilst world-class professionals play with blistering speed and precise control, the power and pace of the game at all levels has changed radically. Modern rackets employing space-age materials are feather light and superbly responsive, allowing movements and shots that were impossible with weighty wooden designs. As the game gets faster and advanced technology is available at all levels of play, the techniques and even the philosophy of playing need to move forward. Dramatic improvement is possible not only for top professionals, but for club and county players. Asia has led the world in the new powerful style of play, dominating international matches for a decade. Korea scooped the last world championship. Lee J. Bok has reached the highest levels of the Korean game, as singles, doubles and mixed doubles champion, and now as an international coach. He has coached the Korean national team, the British Olympic team, and works with players at all levels. He's ideally placed to bring the cream of match play skills to a new audience. Badminton is his life, and he plays to win. I think all abilities would be able to learn something from Lee. The top players would be able to learn something from him um, by his method of play. Once you get into the hole with him, badminton, nothing else, and you're just so focused on what you're doing. It's good. I've known him now for quite some time, and uh, he's a very dedicated person. I would say he's probably one of the most professional coaches I've ever met. Play to win with Lee J. Bok. Take your game apart and learn the right grips, the right strokes, the position and the strategy that will enable you to play to 100% of your ability and enjoy 100% of the game. Play badminton with Lee J. Bok and play to win. So now, if you change your posture, uh, which is lower down, and uh, you focus more to the shuttle, then you could improve your standard 10 or 20 percent immediately. What's important uh, in badminton is speed and timing of the hitting. That's most important uh, rather than power. For example, if you have a that sort of a ready form, you can make a start immediately after you see the shot. So here, Shuttle is there, you can go. But if you stand like the knees are straight there and you touch your heel on the ground, you need to have that action and then go. It takes twice longer than ready like that and then go. Good, stop. Like Simon, he put shuttle in front of his body. But normally club players, what they do, they put their shuttle very close to their body. So it's really very difficult to control it. So remember, put your shuttle to away from your body so you have a good uh, room to control it. Okay, that's one reason. Another reason, if uh, you put your shuttle here, the flying time is longer than you hit the shuttle from there. So if the flying time is longer, that means your opponent have a more time to move forward. So remember, put this is an excellent form here, good. Make sure your shot is not high enough, that's fault. The impact point must be lower than where it's trying. Okay, very good. If you respect your opponent, you will be respected by your opponent. If you do so in your life, you will be respected by other people in normal life. That's what I always believe. I always believe that all of human, if they believe something, then they can achieve it. If they really believe in themselves. It doesn't matter how good coach, or how much time they put on, or uh, what sort of a good uh, surrounding they have. That's nothing. That's the second matter. The most important thing is to have that will to say to you, I will do it. Yes, I can do it. That's the first thing to do. 
before coach, before quality of training, before any good skill practice. That's the second matter. Most important thing is to believe in yourself.